this is a really exciting product that we are going to unbox today in our channel. This is the AOPEN 27HC5R Full HD Gaming Monitor. Now, AOPEN is a brand that many may not have heard of until very recently when media outlets are starting to report that Acer has brought in its subbrand, which is called AOPEN. So what's really exciting about this gaming monitor is that it has a 27 inch curved panel, full HD. It has a overclockable refresh rate of up to 165 Hertz. And it has a good wide viewing angle, blue light shield and ergo stand according to the box. And even this image itself over here shows some excitement already because we all know from this image here, we are actually looking at a pretty slim bezel. So it's not too bad. So let's find out why this thing costs 700 ringgit. Okay, and we're gonna unbox it right now. Oh my God, all right. All right, so we are done taking this out of the box. Not too much of an effort and let's find out what are the contents. So we have got a manual here as usual and we got the AC adapter. Thankfully, there's no huge break that's going to be making your cables really messy. A pretty nice small adapter here. And we are getting another thing here. Let's find out what it is. Apparently, it is the holder for the monitor. This is where you clip the screen on it. And we've got the base of the monitor right here. It's made of plastic, not the glossy plastic, which is good, you know, because I hate those glossy plastic as it scratches really easily. Now, and finally we get a HDMI cable. Cool, it comes with an HDMI cable. Of course, there is another DisplayPort cable that comes together with the package, but you know, because it's the pre-order and I got it. And this is the panel here. Wow, exciting stuff. And here you go. This is a pretty nice looking curved monitor that we are seeing right here. And this is not a bezel. It's actually a sticker right across and there's stickers everywhere. I'm so excited. Let's take a look at the hardware tour of this thing. Okay, I spent quite a bit of time on this monitor playing some games and watching some videos and my experience has so far been pretty decent and this has exceeded my expectations as a good budget gaming monitor. As you can see earlier on, setting up this thing is also very straightforward apart from the fact that there is a screw that you need to manually screw in to secure the monitor and the stand. Now starting off from the build quality, for a 700 ringgit monitor, the A Open Fire Legend is pretty well built. As you can see, it has this really solid tube mechanism. But if you are someone that tends to shake or bang a table a lot, you will get this wobble effect, which is kind of normal for such kind of monitors anyway. The ports are located conveniently at the back where you do not need to bend down and access from the bottom like some other gaming monitors out there and you get two HDMI and a display port and that's actually pretty good because not only you can connect to your PC but you can connect two extra HDMI devices such as a TV box or a gaming console however this thing doesn't support picture-in-picture -picture or picture-by-picture -picture mode so you gotta switch to these devices like in a full screen mode you can have them play side by side so that's kind of expected for a monitor of this price it doesn't have built-in speakers and that's expected as well because even if they do, you will not like the sound quality. The second thing that I really like about this monitor is that it already has VESA mounts on the back here. So if you happen to have a mini PC that has a VESA mount or you would like to use a custom monitor stand, it's ready for you to use it. The third thing that I really like about it is the easy to use on-screen display menu. It's really so simple to use that I think anyone could easily get used to it to get access to the settings of the monitor. Now let's talk about the panel. Now this is a VA panel which strikes the balance between an IPS and TM panel whereby it offers a high refresh rate of 165Hz, a fast response time of 5 milliseconds, and the display quality is actually pretty good as you can see the colors. It's accurate, it has uh, good colors, it has good contrast, and the viewing angles are surprisingly good 
for a curved monitor. Of course, you still get that slight jello effect on the side when it comes to viewing straight and looking at the icons on the side here. You used to see that 3D effect, but it's not as extreme as some curved monitors that I've seen out there. Since this thing has a five millisecond response time, do expect a little bit of ghosting when it comes to playing FPS games because when you move really fast, because of that response time, you tend to see a little bit of ghosting and that's something that you need to get used to. If not, then you will get to get a higher uh, response time monitor out there and that's the purpose of those monitors out there, right? But overall, I can say that this monitor offers a really great value at 699 ringgit and anyone should really go for it if you're on to high refresh rate displays. There's simply no reason like at all to go for a 60 hertz refresh rate monitor anymore when this thing is priced so affordable. So that's pretty much my thoughts about the AOPEN Fire Legend 27 inch curved gaming monitor for today's video. That's pretty much for now. Let me know if you have any questions or comments. Do leave them down in the comment section down below. And if you're interested in purchasing one, do click on the link in the description. That's pretty much for today's video. Thank you very much for watching. Do subscribe to our channel if you haven't done so. Follow us on the usual social media channels and I will see you in our next video.